हाई एवरी वन इन दिस क्लास टॉक अबाउट मेलिंग स्टेप ओके दिस इज दन फीचर ऑफ योर एम एस वर्ड बाई यूजिंग दिस यू कैन सेंड लेटर टू डिफरेंट यूजर्स बट विथ डिफरेंट नेम्स ओके सपोज आई हैव टू सेंड वन लेटर टू योर पेरेंट्स एंड यू आर सिक्सटीन नंबर इन ईच लेटर आई हैव टू चेंज द नेम ऑफ योर फादर otherwise the letters data should be same so in this case we will use this mailing step it is called mail merge this feature is called mail merge okay so to start it you have to click on this start mail merge feature okay as you click on this you will get this list in front of you here you have to select this step by step mail merge wizard As you click on this, here in this right hand side, you will get this type of pane, and this work is of total six steps. From here you can see step one of six. Total six steps are there, and we are on the first step. So in this first step, what we have to do? Select document type. From this list, you can select which type of document you want to create. whether you want to create letter whether you want to create email message where you want to create envelope envelope means that cover in which that the letter should be sent labels means name chit and directory that phone directory and all okay so here we are talking about letter so you have to check this by default it is already checked next you have to click on this this point this link as you click on this now look step 2 of 6 now we are on the second step now here it will ask you select starting document here you can say which document you want to use again you have three features here use the current document means this currently open document do you want to use it or you want to start from a template what are templates templates are the ready made documents and you can find them in this file tab here when you click on new here you will get the sample templates now look these are called templates they are already designed they are already typed and third one is start from existing document existing documents previously saved by you suppose you have already typed one letter and you only want to change the names of the parents so you can use this feature this uh, option and new here i don't have any previously saved document so i am going with this use the current document you have to check on this okay now step 2 complete now step 3 again you have to go to go to this next select recipients look here as you click on this now look step 3 of 6 you are on the third step now in this step you have to choose the list of the recipients recipient means that uh, users that are going to receive the letter here example is your of parents name okay so you have to select the list of your parents name here again we have three options select recipients first use an existing list if you have already made list you can use this feature and you have to click on browse you will get this type of dialog box this type of now if it is saved if you know where it is saved you can go there and you can open it okay select from outlook contacts outlook contact means here we are talking about ms outlook it is a feature of your ms office which allow you to create or to save your contacts in your computer also but we don't have it right now and third one is type a new list so as i told you we are a new user i have to select this one okay as you click as you click on this you will get the option create here look Okay, so you have to click on this create. Now, as you click on create, you will get this box in front of you. If you want to make it for the screen, double click here. Your mouse double click. Now you will get the option. Different types of columns are there. It is not compulsory to fill all. You can fill these columns according to your choice. So, in this title, we have to write Mister. Mrs. or Miss to whom you are 
talking about first name suppose first name is ram last name means surname so surname is sharma okay company we don't need address if you want to write suppose i am writing the like this then address line 2 look at this address line 1 it is address line 2 if you want to write full address write half here and half on this okay but i am just writing the landmark then city ajmer then state suppose raj then zip code pin code country i think you we don't need country because we are talking about india only if you want to write the home phone work phone or email address you can but i don't want okay now if you want to do new entry you have to click here look at the pointer you have to click on this new entry or you can press the tab key look as i press the tab look your cursor is moving like this now we have reached to the end now as i press the tab key you will get the new line okay now again here i am doing one entry mr sham okay here okay this is my like second entry i'm doing one more entry using this new entry now again stir samir lal doing three entries you can do any number of entries it depends on you okay i am doing only only three just to show you the use of it properly now you have to click on okay you will get this type of dialog box it is telling you to save the list that you have made right now so you can give any name suppose i am giving 9a means this is the list of 9a class okay now you can decide where you want to save it i am saving it in documents okay save so as you do this you will get this list in front of you don't need to do anything just click on okay okay so this step 3 is complete now step 4 you have to click on this next write your letter as you click on this here you have to write your letter so first of all in the letter in the starting we have to write this uh, receiver's name and address so for that i have to use this address block okay here you will get different designs here look so you can decide which type of format you want to use it depends on you totally i am selecting this one and click on okay nothing to change then press enter now after that we used to write dear mr sharma or like this so you can select this greeting line here what you want to show dear to or nothing so depends on you i am selecting dear and again what you want to show mr and mrs like this okay then click on okay now press enter after this you have to type your letter so i am using that command for a letter okay suppose this is my letters data now from here So 
this is my complete letter now you have to show here the names and the greeting line you have to click on this step number five preview your letter as you click on this now you can see mr ram sharma adarsh nagar ajmer raj 01 dm sharma and from st francis school ajmer okay this is the letter for roll number one suppose his father name is ram sharma now you can take out the print out of it how i will show you later now second if you want to show the entry of the second roll number so you have to click on this now you can see the letter is same but this name is changed now mr sham singh rangan jachmeer like this dear mr sham singh your student your child is not doing this and all you can try again okay this is the step so oh, this is a second entry of the student now i want to see the third one again click on this look mr samir lal bihari ganj like this this is the third entry okay now if you want to take out the print out of this you have to complete the merge step number 6 as you click on this here you will get option like print and edit individual letters so you have to click on print now as you do this you will get this box in front of you now it is asking you how much records you want to take out the print out it is checked all if you click on this they will start printing all the letter 60 entries in your letter that 60 will be printed but if you say no i want to take out the print out of starting 10 only so you can go from here from 1 to 10 we don't have 10 here we have only 3 If I want to take out the printout of one and two, so I can select it from here. Okay. And if you want to take out the printout of only this document, which one is currently open, or you can say the entry which is currently open, you have to click on this only. Current record. Okay. As you do this, as you press the OK, this will start printing. Okay. You'll get this type of dialog box. From here, you have to select the printer, which printer is installed in your PC. and then you have to click on okay this is the way by which you can use the mail merge total six steps are there and it is very important for your office work that's it for this video if you like the video please share subscribe to my youtube channel and press the bell icon thank you